Okay, so we're building on this understanding of buoyancy and really trying to get people who might just choose not to be active because it hurts to be able to get themselves in the water and really feel themselves moving. And that, the benefits of buoyancy really come into play. Yeah, buoyancy, the biggest thing about buoyancy is it decreases the effect of gravity on the body. So for a lot of individuals who have trouble walking on the outside or on land because of pain, they tend to take smaller steps. In the water, we're gonna have the same individual focus on the range of motion of their hips and knees by taking bigger steps in a safe environment. The other thing you're gonna notice is we've added float weights to this client. This client has uh, flotation devices on their ankles. It, it's more like working on power walking in order to increase the challenge for this person. We can even take that up one more step by adding an upper extremity workout using floats. And this way she's really getting a workout. She has to work her core stability while controlling the ankle pads and the hand weight. You wouldn't think it was much, but really when you add in the resistance of water, it makes a difference. But you're looking also, while this is challenging, you're looking at just being able to get people moving again and getting them through movement that they take for granted on a daily basis. And that's it, because what we do notice for anyone who's in pain is they start losing range of motion and strength when they're walking. So this is a fantastic option in order to maximize range of motion and strength for those who have lower extremity pain.